So we begin in Escondido with the latest on a deadly crash involving a 13-year-old girl who ran over and killed two homeless men after taking her mom's SUV for a joyride. This shows the SUV after it went off the road late Friday night. And tonight we are seeing the moment that crash happened. Fox 5's Liberty Zabala is live on Mission Avenue with that new video and reaction from a neighbor who heard the crash. Liberty. Good evening, Jason. Well, Escondido police are investigating how these teenagers could have caused so much damage. We can still see where the car skid off the road here and slammed into the wall behind me. Now, we spoke with a neighbor who caught it all on camera, and I have to warn you, what you're about to see may be disturbing. <laughs> Disturbing video from a neighbor's ring camera shows the moment a 13-year-old Vista girl fleeing police lost control of her mother's car and slammed into two men on the sidewalk. The car was just speeding off right here. I'm not sure if they were trying to make a turn and uh, just didn't handle it and then just went straight to the wall. Police say another 13-year-old girl was in the passenger seat. Officers say the driver took her mother's car without her knowledge. Police believe the two men she hit were homeless. Well, what are they thinking, you know? Because we read on the report that I guess they were coming from Vista. And we're like, well, Vista's pretty far from Escondido to be driving if you're 13 years old. Especially if I don't believe you know how to drive at that age. One man died at the scene, the other died at the hospital. Former police officer Kevin LaChapelle says it is unlikely the teens will be charged as adults due to California law. Uh, at 14, a uh, juvenile can be charged as an adult. Um, she's 13. Um, the other thing you look at is, you know, intent, for example, um, who would have known that there were two men sleeping in the brush uh, where this happened? On the other hand, they, they will be held accountable for this. La Chapelle says their parents also face liability. There should be some justice. I mean, the homeless, maybe they don't have much family or something that could, you know, uh, but I believe they deserve justice as well. And police also had to deal with yet another crash after the initial crash here when a DUI driver crashed into a patrol car that was blocking the road here. Now they arrested that DUI driver and they also arrested the two teenagers, but then released the teenagers to their parents. For now, live here in Escondido, Liberty Zavala, Fox 5 News.